हेलो नमस्कार गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम टू पी आई बी ट्वेंटी फोर सेवन मैं हूँ मनीष मिश्रा एंड इन दिस सेशन वी विल डिस्कस फाइव क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द पी आई बी न्यूज सो लेट्स बिगिन विद क्वेश्चन नंबर वन द ट्राइबल कोऑपरेटिव मार्केटिंग डेवलपमेंट फेडरेशन ऑफ इंडिया विच इन शॉर्ट इज ट्राइफेड ऑर्गेनाइज अ वेबिनार इन द वेक ऑफ कोविड नाइनटीन फॉर वर्चुअल ट्रेनिंग ऑफ ट्राइफेड ट्रेनर्स एंड सेल्फ हेल्प ग्रुप्स ट्राइफेड ऑर्गेनाइज दिस वेबिनार इन कोलेबोरेशन विद विच ऑर्गेनाइजेशन So guys Trifed was established in 1987 it works under Ministry of Tribal Affairs headed by Arjun Munda headed by Arjun Munda his Lok Sabha constituency is Khunti Khunti is in Jharkhand and current chief minister of Jharkhand is Hemant Soren and this Trifed was established for socio economic development of tribal people socio economic development of tribal people and it creates a market for ट्राइबल प्रोडक्ट्स ओके ट्राइबल पीपल के सोशो इकोनॉमिक डेवलपमेंट के लिए ट्राइफेड को बनाया गया था इन द ईयर 1987 इट वर्क्स अंडर मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ ट्राइबल अफेयर्स हेडेड बाय अर्जुन मुंडा एंड दिस वेबिनार इज टू क्रिएट अवेयरनेस अमंग द कम्युनिटी अबाउट सोशल डिस्टेंसिंग एंड स्टेप्स टू बी फॉलोड एंड डूज एंड डोंट्स एडवाइजरीज ड्यूरिंग कलेक्शन ऑफ नॉन टिम्बर फॉरेस्ट प्रोड्यूस एंड टू प्रोवाइड सजेस्टिव प्रैक्टिस फॉर मेंटेनिंग पर्सनल हाइजीन adopting cashless practices and etc and it is also uh, there to reach more than 18000 participants and cover tribal regions across all uh, all the 27 states so trifed organized this webinar in collaboration with unicef and who unicef headquarter is in new york and it is headed by henrietta four who is headquartered in geneva it is headed by tedros adhanom and this webinar for uh, was organized for virtual training of tribal trainers and self help groups on basic orientation on covid-19 response and key preventive highlighting the importance of social distancing measures to ensure that tribal gatherers carry on their work safely all right so this uh, organized this webinar was organized with the help of who and unicef so guys therefore the correct answer is e both a and b okay question number 2 is hrd minister shri ramesh pokhriyal nishank whose head uh, lok sabha constituency is haridwar in uttarakhand in april 2020 launched a novel campaign called bharat padhe online what was the main objective of this campaign so guys this campaign was launched on 10th april 2020 and it invites ideas from students parents teachers academicians and other stakeholders to improve the online education system in india india ke online education system ko improve karne ke liye is campaign ne ideas invite kare hain from students parents teachers academicians aur jo uh, aur stakeholders hain unse and it is a campaign for crowd sourcing of ideas for improving online education ecosystem of india aur jo ideas hain that can be shared on bharat padhe online dot mhrd@gmail.com and on twitter by using hashtag bharat pade online up to 16th april 2020 and according to pib more than 3500 ideas already aa chuke hain so guys aur ye iska campaign page hai so bharat pade online is a campaign which invites ideas from students parents teacher academicians and other stakeholders to improve the online education system in india is time uh, during the period of lockdown जो स्कूल है या और जो बाकी एजुकेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन है उनको काफी परेशानियों का सामना करना पड़ रहा है क्योंकि हमारे पास कोई रोबस्ट इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर नहीं है टू प्रोवाइड द ऑनलाइन एजुकेशन टू आर स्टूडेंट्स सो उसी के लिए ये कैंपेन लॉन्च किया गया था ताकि उस ऑल ओवर इंडिया से आइडियाज इन्वाइट किए जा सके ताकि हम अपने ऑनलाइन लर्निंग सिस्टम को इम्प्रूव कर सके सो दैट इन फ्यूचर अगर कोई फिर से कोई प्रॉब्लम होती है तो हमारा ऑनलाइन एजुकेशन सिस्टम काफी समर्थ हो कि उस समस्या का समाधान निकाल सके राइट सो गाइज द करेक्ट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इज फॉर क्राउड सोर्सिंग ऑफ आइडियाज फॉर इंप्रूविंग ऑनलाइन एजुकेशन सिस्टम सो बी इज द करेक्ट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन नाउ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज अटल इनोवेशन मिशन नीति आयोग एंड नेशनल इंफॉर्मेटिक सेंटर एनआईसी इन अप्रैल टू थाउजेंड एंड ट्वेंटी ज्वाइंटली लॉन्च अ कंप्यूटर इनेबल्ड सॉफ्टवेयर सिस्टम providing a total engineering solution from 2d drafting and detailing to 3 uh, 3d product design what is the name of the software so guys atal innovation mission it is an initiative of niti aayog and uh, it is to promote 
uh, innovation it is to promote innovation and entrepreneurship in india theek hai entrepreneurship aur innovation ko promote karne ke liye atal innovation mission uh, was is an initiative of niti aayog and there are also other initiative under atal innovation missions like atal tinkering labs and atal incubators you might have heard of all these things atal tinkering labs and atal incubators atal tinkering lab is to promote creativity and uh, innovative mindset in schools and atal incubators is to promote entrepreneurship in universities and in industries okay industries or university mein entrepreneurship ko badhane ke liye atal incubator mission hai and atal tinkering labs is to promote creativity and innovative mindset in schools okay and niti aayog chairperson is prime minister of india its ceo is amitabh kant amitabh kant and its vice chairperson currently is rajiv kumar okay and niti aayog is headquartered in new delhi now uh, atal innovation mission niti aayog and nic national informatics center has launched this app collab cat okay to provide a total engineering solution from 2d drafting and detailing to 3d product design it is to provide a great platform to students of atal tinkering labs across country to create and modify 3d designs with free flow of creativity and imagination and 3d printing kya hota hai it is a process of making three dimensional solid objects from a digital file and it has been used to create car parts smartphone cases fashion accessories medical equipments and artificial organs so therefore guys the correct answer to this question is correct answer is guys uh, d collab cat so collab cat is the correct answer and this software has been launched by atal innovation mission niti aayog and national informatics center question number 4 is to monitor and record the efforts and initiatives of ministry of hrd taken in the wake of covid 19 union minister ramesh pokhriyal nishank has launched a web portal yukti and what does t refer in this portal एक वेब पोर्टल युक्ति लॉन्च किया है मिनिस्टर फॉर एचआरडी रमेश पोखरियाल निशंक ने हमें बताना है कि इस युक्ति में टी क्या है और राइट सो इन युक्ति युक्ति रेफर्स टू यंग इंडिया कंबैटिंग कोविड विद नॉलेज टेक्नोलॉजी एंड इनोवेशन सो देर फोर टी स्टैंड फॉर वॉट टेक्नोलॉजी एंड रमेश पोखरियाल निशंक हैज लॉन्च दिस वेब पोर्टल इन New Delhi and this portal aims to monitor and record the efforts and initiatives of Ministry of HRD which have been taken in the wake of COVID-19. COVID-19 के वजह से जो भी uh, efforts और initiatives of Ministry of HRD ने लिए हैं उसको monitor करने के लिए ये portal launch किया गया था and it will cover the various initiatives and efforts of the institutions in academics and research especially related to COVID. social initiative by institution and the measures taken for the betterment of the total wellbeing of the students and this portal will cover both qualitative and quantitative parameters for effective delivery of service to the academic community at large okay so therefore guys the correct answer to this question is c technology c technology and remember yukti stands for young india combating covid with knowledge technology and innovation now guys question number 5 is the ministry of agriculture and farmers uh, has launched kisan rath mobile app to facilitate transportation of food grains and perishable during lockdown consider the following statement and identify the correct statement among these five statements okay so let us discuss about this kisan rath app so union minister of agriculture and farmers shri narendra tomar has launched this app kisan rath app it aims to facilitate transportation of food grains and perishables during lockdown and this app is developed by national informatic uh, informatics center which is backed by ministry of electronics and information and Techno- uh, information technology headed by ravi shankar prasad whose lok sabha constituency is patna sahib this app will facilitate farmers and traders in searching transport vehicles for primary and secondary transportation for movement of agriculture and horticulture produce in primary transportation movement from farm to mandis fpo collection center and warehouses etc is included and in secondary transportation movement from mandis to intra, uh, intrastate and interstate mandis 
Processing units, railway station, warehouses and wholesaler sector is included. And this app also facilitates traders in transportation of perishable commodities by refer or refrigerated vehicles. And it will be available in 8 languages initially including English and Hindi. And this app is expected to connect farmers and traders to a network of more than 5 lakh trucks and 20,000 tractors. And there are some benefits of this app like the government has granted relaxation in the nationwide lockdown for activities related to agriculture and farming and allied activities with a view to address problem being faced by the farming community. Farming community ki samasyaan ko dhyan mein rakhte hai, government ne agriculture, farming aur usse allied activities ko lockdown mein kuch chhoot di hai and this app will be a stepping stone towards provision of timely transportation service at competitive rates for farmers and traders besides achieving a reduction in food wastage. फूड वेस्टेज कम करने के साथ साथ ये एक काफी बहुत बड़ा एक स्टेपिंग स्टोन होगा टुवर्ड्स टाइमली ट्रांसपोर्टेशन सर्विस एट कॉम्पिटेटिव रेट सही दाम पे किसानों को और ट्रेडर्स को ट्रांसपोर्टेशन सर्विस प्रोवाइड कराई जा कराई जा पाएगी एंड दिस विल हेल्प इन इंश्योरिंग बेटर प्राइसेस ऑफ द प्रोड्यूस टू फार्मर्स ओके सो नाउ लेट्स मूव ऑन टू द क्वेश्चन वी हैव टू फाइंड द Correct statement. So this app is developed by National Informatics Center. Yes, this is correct. And it will facilitate farmers and traders in searching transport vehicles for uh, only primary transportation. No, it is for both primary and secondary. It will facilitate farmers and traders in searching transport vehicles for secondary transportation. Yes, this is correct. Because यहाँ पे only नहीं लिखा हुआ है. अगर only लिखा हुआ होता तो ये गलत हो जाता. Because this is for both primary and secondary. So, अगर यहाँ पे only नहीं लिखा है तो secondary transportation वाली बात बिल्कुल सही होगी and it facilitates traders in transportation of perishable uh, commodities by refrigerator vehicles. This is also correct and this mobile app will be made available in six languages. No, it is available in eight languages. All right. So, guys, we have to identify the correct statement and therefore first is, uh, statement is correct, third is correct and fourth is correct. So, therefore, the correct answer to this question is A, one, three and four. Okay, so guys, that's it for today. I hope you like the session. For more updates, do subscribe our channel and press the bell icon. We'll see you next session. Mein. Goodbye, take care, God bless, and keep watching PIB 24/7. Sombar se shukravar subah 8 baje only on anujandal.in.